In my previous video, I demonstrated Ethernet communication between Arduino and Python GUI. In this video, temperature and humidity sensor DHT11 is connected to Arduino, sending sensor readings to Python GUI using the Ethernet network. A block diagram of the implemented system is shown here. We have the Arduino connected to the Ethernet shield. The shield has this MAC address and IP address. A DHT11 sensor is connected to one of the digital pins of the Arduino. The sensor can send temperature and humidity readings through the Ethernet network to be displayed on the Python GUI. And now for a quick demonstration. The user can click the temperature button to get a temperature reading in Celsius from the sensor or click the humidity button to get humidity measurement in percentage. A quick look at the Python sketch. When we click on the temperature button, the program jumps to this function definition. And then we have this string constant is sent to the Arduino. And within the try statement, we wait to receive the temperature reading from the Arduino and save it in this uh, string variable. And then display it on the output text field. When we click on the humidity button, we jump to this function definition. And we send this string constant to the Arduino. And then wait to receive the humidity value and save it in this string variable and then display it on the output text field. If the connection between Arduino and Python is lost, when we click on the temperature button, the accept will be executed and not available value will appear on the output. The same also goes for humidity. Now we look at the Arduino sketch. Within the loop function, we wait for a data packet from the Python sketch. When we receive the packet, we read the data bytes and save it in the array, and then convert the byte array into a string. And then we check the value of the string. If it's temp, then we get the temperature reading from DHT11, and then we send it to the Python sketch. If the string has this value, then we get the humidity from the DHT11 sensor and then transmit it to the Python sketch. In future videos, more peripherals and sensors will be connected to the Ethernet enabled Arduino. Thank you for watching.